Hi guys, Lana here. As you saw from the title, I'm here to review the Revlon Mushroom Blonde 72B. I didn't find any reviews on this particular color, so I wanted to review it since I get to try it. Um, I believe it's the cheapest hair color you can get. Maybe I'm wrong. I think it is. It's around, it's almost four dollars, three something. Um, yeah, so I saw it and I thought it was very beautiful. It's, I was looking for something light but not yellowy and this color looked very pretty to me so i decided to give it a try but let me give you some background of with what i started so my hair was bleached to orangey yellow then i colored it with this which um. is cool and it turned out to be not cool at all it was actually bronzy bronzy brown pretty dark and i did not like the color so i decided to remove the color with l'oreal hair remover hair color remover which removes artificial color so this is what I used to get rid of the dark. It wasn't really dark, but it was. It is medium brown. So medium brown. I used the hair color remover. I have to say that I used two of these for my hair. It, my hair is not long, but it's very thick. So I did use two of these, and I removed all the medium brown, and I was left with what I had before, which was bleached, orangey, yellowy hair color, which was not pretty. After I removed the hair color, I ended up with the same orangey, dark blonde orangey color. If I'll be able, I'll insert some pictures of how it looked when I did that. So, after I removed the hair color, the brown, I decided to color it this color the next day. But I conditioned my hair with some deep conditioner so it feels much better because it was bleached. Um, I also used two of these boxes and I'm glad I did use two because one wouldn't be enough for my hair for sure. I have a lot of hair. So um one thing i forgot to tell you about this uh, hair remover it doesn't just remove your hair color that you used previously it also can bleach your natural hair your virgin hair what um, that has no color in it let's say you had some your some of your hair at the roots is was your nature your natural virgin hair if you put directly this on your hair, which the darker, if you are lightening it, right? So if you're removing darker color, if your roots were virgin hair and you put it directly on your roots, on your natural hair color, it will lighten your hair as well. So keep that in mind. If you do not want to do that, then avoid your natural color because it will also change not only the color that you're removing but your virgin hair will get kind of like bleached that's i believe that would um this color remover does at least it did for me and i did use it a couple of times it wasn't my first time so i knew it but just for you to keep in mind that it will lighten it will bleach your hair as well so now let's get to this color. So that's the result I got. I'm 
pretty satisfied and happy with the color. I think it's very, very accurate. The only one thing that I want to say that you need to be aware of what color you start with because if you have dark color, it will do nothing to your hair. If you have very light color, let's say you, you're platinum blonde, then you're gonna turn pretty gray. So my hair was like banana yellow and some parts were very light, some were darker and some, like some of my back hair was very dark, like not very, but medium brown. So it was darker. So those parts that were darker became a little orangey. The lighter the hair was, the lighter, uh, the gray was picked up more. So I would say the best result was on the hair that was, it was not platinum blonde, like some of my strength, but on the color that was orangey yellow was the best result. I do like the result because my hair had many different kind of strength in it and it blends very it did blend very well and i'm satisfied with it but just to just to let you know to keep in mind that it the color itself depends on what you color it on so first in order to get this color you need to in, get your hair pretty light as you can see here that's what i had on most of my Hey, most of my hair was this color, some strength were this color and some at the roots were even darker than that, closer to brown, I would say. So you can see the range of those colors. It's pretty accurate. I don't know if the camera is picking up right, but I would say it worked very well. I was actually surprised how it worked. Just keep in mind that when you color your hair this with this color, it should be light enough in order to get the results you want. If you're gonna have anything darker than that, you will not get this result. It's only if you have light enough hair. In order to get this, you have to, if you have darker hair, you need to bleach it, maybe not once, but twice, it depends on your hair. Just make some, you know, do some research and see. But I suggest you don't even try it unless you have hair color, hair color, your hair color is this color. If you're anything darker than that, your hair may turn kind of orangey, not the prettiest color from what I understood from uh, ex my experience. So I would say this color works really well. I did like it. I, and I still do like how it turned out. So, yeah, Revlon. I never saw this color before. I'm not sure if it's new, but yeah. So here is your review. If you are looking for this color to try out, I think you should. I think it's a very pretty, it's not orangey, it's not yellowy, it even gives a little bit of that, I would say pinkish, kind of a tiny bit pinkish undertone, not much, but you can definitely see that it has a tiny bit of that pinkish, little bit undertone. I'll turn around, make sure that you are able to see. So my hair turned out to be a few shades because my hair was different when I started coloring it. So it was, I had very light strength, bleached, almost platinum like these ones. And I had darker ones. And so that's how it turned out. And it blends well. I do like it. I need to say I do like it a lot. I'm very satisfied with how it turned out. So, 
if you are looking to try it i hope you will and will let me know what you think just keep in mind the main thing is what color you start with because if you start with too dark you'll not get the result so yeah that's all for me and i hope it was helpful in any way yeah take care